in front of the cameras, it was all smiles. Britain and America will stand side by side. But the documents released today by the British National Archives reveal some tempestuous moments. After Argentina invaded the Falkland Islands in the South Atlantic Ocean in 1982, Prime Minister Thatcher launched a land and sea invasion to take them back, counting on President Reagan for support telling him, you are the only person who will understand. But Mr. Reagan hesitated, afraid that U.S. support would offend Argentina's Latin American allies. The relationship hit its lowest point during the Falklands War, when President Reagan kept urging the Prime Minister to negotiate a truce, a suggestion she flatly rejected. 255 soldiers died before Britain retook the islands. In time, the relationship warmed. She once signed a letter wishing the president, then a bit under the weather, a rapid recovery to full health and strength. The world needs you. Other documents reveal that Mr. Reagan's aides ask for fashion advice. What should the president wear for a horseback ride with the queen? The answer, nothing formal, more smart, casual. And so a president, famous as a star of Hollywood Westerns, rode out looking like anything but an American cowboy. Barry Peterson, CBS News, London.